Within each AS, an intra-AS routing protocol should run, known as interior gateway protocol. Interior gateway protocol finds the best path between the routers within AS. RIP, OSPF, ISIS, and IGRP are among the famous intra-AS routing protocols. RIP is based on distance vector, and others are based on link state routing. OSPF and ISIS are very similar, and we are seeing wider adoption of ISIS more recently, mostly due to its simplicity and more flexibility. Let's learn a little bit more about one of these protocols. OSPF stands for Open Shortest Path First. Open means that the specification for the routing protocol is publicly available. It is available through RFC 2328. This is as opposed to, for example, Cisco's EIGRP, which only recently became publicly available. OSPF uses link state algorithm. Nodes advertise link state within the network by flooding the network with link state packets from every node when they join the network, when they have a link state change, or periodically to maintain. OSPF runs Dijkstra's algorithm to find the least cost path and maintain the topological map of the network at each node. OSPF messages are directly over the IP protocol. Some of the important features of OSPF protocol are its security, support of ECMP, and multicast. All OSPF routers are authenticated to prevent malicious intrusion by unknown routers. Messages could also be authenticated with shared secrets. This adds to the security of the network. OSPF maintains ECMP, which means equal cost multipaths. It finds and keeps all the paths that have the same least cost to the destination. This is important for a number of reasons, such as load balancing and traffic engineering that we will learn about in more advanced discussions. OSPF also can support multicast, which is sending from one source to multiple destinations. OSPF can also be used for hierarchical implementation in larger domains. This figure shows an example of hierarchical OSPF with two-level hierarchy, backbone area and local area. The goal of the backbone is to route traffic between the different areas within the AS. Link state advertisement is only within each area. Therefore, the area local routers flood link state advertisement in their area only and compute routing within their area. They forward packets to outside areas using area border router. The area border routers summarize distances to destinations in their own area, advertising to backbone. Boundary routers connect other AASs with backbone routers running OSPF limited to backbone for this task. OSPF is a fairly complex protocol. We are not going to discuss the details of this protocol in this course, limiting our discussion to this high-level introduction. If you're interested to learn more, please start with taking a look at RFC 2328 for OSPF version 2 and RFC 5340 expanding it for IPv6.